What up, though? Wednesday morning. Did you vlog much yesterday? Yeah. Okay. I'm sitting down, about to edit Daily Dose. Just recorded my action blog video for today. Um, we uh, we gotta hurry. We gotta leave in like in like a little bit less than an hour. Uh, meeting. You know, it's tax season. Got to get that done. So uh, we got a meeting to get that all handled, which is just fun. We're learning a lot, though. You know, since we've been, it's it's a lot different from. You know when you get a, when you got a job and um, when you're kind of self-employed and how you got to pay them and file them, it's all different. So a good heads up to some of y'all that might be going in business for yourself, or or uh, or uh, might be starting YouTube. Remember, it's not like it's not just done for you when like when you have a job. So don't think that hey, I get all this money that's going to me. No, you got to pay taxes on it. Remember that. You get yourself in big trouble. Um, but yeah, so we got to do that. We're off to do that. And then... I thought you had something else, right? I mean, it really depends on you. You had gymnastics. Yeah, Lavelle has gymnastics. I want to get Larry's ears pierced soon. It'd be so much better if we could push that back to some other, some other day. Fine. Okay. So Lavelle won't, Lyric won't get her ears pierced today, but we'll get it soon. Um, Lavelle has gymnastics. I don't think she's going to make that. I think this appointment is going to take forever. You think so? I think so. We've been trying to make gymnastics happen all month, y'all. Yeah. Wish me luck. Good gracious. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and, but then, and then, uh, and then, uh, um, we got church later. We got to be there at five. Which is rough. So I really would like to stream, but I don't know how I'm gonna do all that. So I'm editing daily dose now. And then alright, I gotta go. Yo yo, so we are mobbing right now. All of us in Best Buy. Trying to get me a, a new keyboard and mouse. Trying to go MLG with it, but I thought we'd stop by, see if they had anything good. Doesn't look like it. Probably have to get it online. Uh, cause I, I just don't wanna have to wait for the shipping. So if we can get some locally, that's ideal. But it's not looking like it so far. Psych, I lied. Best Buy for the win. Look at all this. Amazing. Woo! Woo! Look, you, that sounds gamey. Does it? You hear it? What does this do? Are you left handed? Uh, this goes, yeah, I use my left hand for this. Ooh! <laughs> okay. over here that'll do different features like switching weapons or stuff like that. Mm -hmm. A lot of what they try to do is so you can macro them here, this way you have everything close to one. Uh, okay. I mean a lot of your mouses you can do it with too as well. So they'll have buttons on the side where you can program them. Oh, basically oh, do certain yeah. features as well. Yeah, okay. Oh wow. Do you, do you reach the I like World of Warcraft and stuff, but for me, it's, it makes it easier yeah. just having everything there. Then I'll just have to go down and click it. Or this doesn't ever get like confusing. Like, are you able to touch it? Yeah. At first, I had a little headset, right, headset but sometimes I feel like I don't hear the directions. I want to take so a picture. A lot of those, the reason being is some of your push, headsets are push just this doing your standard two channel stereo. Don't just keep pushing so it. Like really you gotta get your both in the picture. Like ah. Push the button now. Some of them will. Um, there we go. You took I a picture. I don't know if I have any headsets for the PC Matt? right now that are doing like I'm not. Your, um, I'm looking at the picture. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Take a picture. Your finger's covering oh, it. Oh my goodness. Oh, yeah. CC. Oh, really? Stop. Ah. I quit pushing it so many times. I want to do it. I want to do it. Like like All right, take a selfie. A picture. Cheese. Cheese. Okay. You hold it in front of you. Like this. Yeah, you just want to look. You're, what you're looking for is they're not doing like a true 5.1 or 7. Kind of like a manipulated, Lavelle. but they're doing well enough with it. Lavelle, able to hear directions come back. Like I have just a little headset for the... Get back. Get back. I'm going to warn that it is. I'm going to 
I'm live right now. Um, okay, so basically, <laughs> I'm about to be dope. My man explained it to me. And my wifey about to get probably a little bit annoyed. Because I got to sit here, I got to Google a couple things and look at a few of these. But we're leaving here. A big shout out to Uncut. A big shout out to Wes. A big shout out to all the people that's been some of the bigger donors lately. First off, shout out to everyone. All of it adds up and it, and it counts. But um, those big ones are, are really what allowed us to go out and make this purchase now. So um, I'm going to try and stream earlier today and I shall, y'all shall see improvements. I'm going to be official. We might leave with a headset, a keyboard, and a mic. Just depends on how we budget it. Um, but I'm definitely excited. A headset, a keyboard, and a mic? Yes. I need a head I need a new headset so I can hear it. I need the 5.1 Dolby. What do you need another mic for? We just Dolby. bought a mic. Oh, wait. Well, a headset is a mic, my bad. A headset, a keyboard, and a mouse. Yeah. Not a mic. Play NBA in 2K. <laughs> oh, okay. You said Oh, you said So a headset, a keyboard, and a mouse. Okay. Love you. Night night. Night night, right? Mm. Night night, girls. Mm. What's wrong? You okay? Okay. Night night. All right. Just got home from Best Buy. Um, Hubby's gonna try to stream right now with all his snazzy stuff. I have cleaning to do, <laughs> and yeah, I'm gonna handle that. Yo, stream has life. Been here? So a little later than we wanted to. I told him to say what up today. Is this spot does. new or am I tripping? Or am I just like tripping off of the new servers being added? It's like and I'm 500 people in here. That's pretty good for the middle of the afternoon during the week. Because I swear I've never been here. He said his new mouse is pretty sensitive. So we'll see how he does. All his clicking. What, Ray? I'm hungry. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. I sound like a little old man. No, I don't. Yes, you do. No, I don't. I'm hungry. I made burgers. You want a burger and some chips? Thank you for that sub, man. I missed it. I don't want burgers. Stop whining. Quit talking like that. Your face doesn't look cute, and you don't sound cute when you talk like that. Talk like a big girl. What would you like for lunch? What you don't you want mean, a bro? burger? Then what do you want? I want peanut butter sandwich and jelly. Okay, well, I'll make you a peanut butter sandwich and jelly in a few minutes. You don't buy beef, man. We're friends. <laughs> okay. Okay. That's fine. You want the beef? Can you tell Mav to... No. Uh... Where you at? <laughs> Will you be back after church? All right. I got to help, of course, our normal... Mods aren't all in here. Bro, we got Lily. Shout out to Lily. Lily on point. So, yeah. I gotta deal with everybody else. There. You shouted yourself out. Congratulations to you. I hate you. You're dumb. My mouse is too sensitive, man. It's not because you're good. <laughs> so this is what we're going through. Uh. With this is a mouse. <laughs> I guess that answers how he's doing. <laughs> why, he's, why he's vlogging that, that, that death right there every day. Oh, so funny. Hey, how do I, does anyone know how to like lower sensitivity on the mouse? I'm like <laughs> going everywhere with it. I want to see. I guess you guys got to see it already. Did you show them everything all, all lit up? Yeah. Look well, at how pretty. MLG mouse, MLG keyboard. What is What's ML? Good? Why do you keep saying MLG? It's what is MLG? Gaming. That means you're a prof that's like the professional gaming circuit thing. Oh my gosh, we were in Best Buy and he was like, I gotta be MLG, babe. I gotta be MLG. <laughs> what does that even mean? 10% chance, huh? Thanks for streaming, man. LaVelle, 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 LaVelle. 
Say hi to the people. Say hi. Hi, people. She was already waking up. I got Mama Ray over here. Did Lavelle sleep? Lavelle needs to sleep, Mom. Let Lavelle sleep. I'm not mommy. <laughs> oh, then stop acting like it. <laughs> Did you have a good nap? Yeah. All right, girls want peanut butter and jelly. I gotta make peanut butter and jelly happen. Mommy duties. <sighs> oh, looks better down here though, right? Right. At church, early. Walking through the drama for today. All right. Come on again. Let's go to Blackout when you're ready. We'll get started. On the top. That's what you say, right? Yeah. All right, let's start that video. All right, so just finished running through it. I'm probably going to wait to show you guys the drama until it's actually done in the service, but it's really good. It's really powerful behind it. So or it's, really, it's really powerful. So what it is about is just the power of what Jesus did on the cross. A lot of people don't. Like he didn't just die to die. There's so much power behind his death and resurrection. Um, that gives us the victory over all of, um, you know, the different uh, things that the enemy throws at us, whether it's depression, shame, addiction, um, all of that. All right, let's you know, do it one more time. Low feelings of self-worth. So we're about to practice again, but I just want to give you that preface. The pref I need to preface it before I throw to it. Um, and you guys actually know what you're looking for and what it means when you're watching it. Because we just watched it now and I thought it was really awesome. some addictions that stuff that we are addicted to and uh, we can't seem to break it and we can't seem to get free of it and it's just like this addiction whether it's drugs alcohol or maybe you look at things you shouldn't look at or addicted to lust you just have all these different things right and and, and this is our life and, and and what happens is we have these different sins and it starts to kind of clutter it, it starts to kind of mess us up we had this like clean slate and then all of a sudden man we're all jacked up and, and in our sin we have separated ourselves from God and that's what happens we we end up sinning and we do all these different things and we perform all these different things and we really destroy our lives we separate ourselves from Jesus but they're really Really cool thing about God. The cool, cool, awesome, wonderful thing about Jesus is that no matter how much we put on Him, no matter how much we sin, no matter how jacked up we might be, no matter how much we've made mistakes, no matter how much we've screwed up, no matter how much we've messed up, no matter how much we've done, Jesus still loved us enough to die on a cross for us. Because he can look at us and say, you might be a, an addict, you might be full of hate, you might be a gossip, you might have all these sexual sins, you might uh, treat people incorrectly, you might do a lot of these things, you might, you might be sad, you might be depressed, you might be lonely, you might be all these things. And some of you in this place, you feel like, man, I'm a total mess. I've got, I've got all the things you listed up there, plus a whole lot more. Stevie, you don't even understand. I have no joy in my life. I have no happiness in my life. I'm just miserable, and I'm depressed, and I'm suicidal, and all this junk that's gone on. Here's the reality, that at the end of the day, we're all just broken vessels in need of God's amazing grace. The amazing grace of Jesus that he loved you and I so much that he gave his life on the cross. That even though we have all these mistakes, he can still love us, he can still forgive us. He's not through with you when you make mistakes. You just set yourself up for his forgiveness. He's ready to forgive you even tonight. You have to allow him. Holy 
of rock and different things and what they would do is they take that whip and they dip it in goat's blood for two reasons because they believed that goat's blood when mixed with human blood was like poison and also what it would do is when they would stick whip somebody with it the goat's blood would act like a glue when mixed with human blood and they would take this whip and this is what they did to Jesus and you know the Bible says in John 3 16 for God so loved the world that he gave his only son that whosoever believed in him should not perish but have everlasting life and I think sometimes we read that and we just pass over it and I think we need to understand that God so loves you that he so cared about you that he's so in love and passionate about you that he endured something they would take the whip they would hit him and the broken pieces of rock would stick into his skin and then what the Romans would do is they would take the whip and they'd twist it counterclockwise and they'd rip out his flesh and there was no rules to this they could have spun Jesus around and hit him right in the face over and over they'd hit him and rip out his flesh he was beaten so severely that the Bible tells us in the book of Isaiah that you couldn't even tell that he was a human being the beating that Jesus endured for you was intense because he knew you would sin because he knew you would make mistakes because he knew I needed him he didn't stop there after the beating that he endured where his flesh and muscle and fiber and tissue was ripped out they took Jesus in front of everybody they took him to the hill where two criminals were next to him and they stripped him of his clothes and hung him on a cross put a nail in each of his hands and a nail through his feet and he hung on a cross a sacrifice for your sin and for mine as he's there he's going through some things and the people were mocking him they were spitting on him and laughing at him this entire time as he's going through all this they were, had ripped out his beard they put a crown of thorns on his head mocking the fact that he said he was the king of kings and the lord of lords because he's my king and I hope tonight you make him your king and they, they put it on him and as he's up there on the cross as they're mocking him saying if you be the son of God why don't you call the angels down and bring yourself down from the cross but listen it wasn't those nails that hung Jesus to the cross it was his love for you it was his passion for you that hung him there and as he's there one of the one of the uh, thieves that were next to him begins to mock him as well the other thief tells the other one he says hey leave him alone and he looks at Jesus and he says remember me remember me where you're going he acknowledged that Jesus is Lord and this is how I know that you've not gone too far this is how I know that no matter how bad you've been how much mistakes you've made how much you've rejected God that all it takes is you to ask for his forgiveness and one drop of the blood of Jesus wipes it all away and washes you white as snow and says you're forgiven he looks at that thief and says listen to me today you will be with me in paradise that thief deserved to be there Jesus didn't he was perfect he had to be the perfect sacrifice for you and I but he looks at him says today you will be with me in paradise and then as Jesus is breathing some of his last breath he's up there and he's dying and he's got all this going on and he's breathing and he's breathing heavily and before he dies he says something significant his last words on that cross as he's breathing his last and as he's going through everything that's happening he yells out it is finished yes which out of the Greek the words it is finished means telestia which translates to an accounting term paid in full see because the Bible says that the wages of sin what you're owed for sin the debt is death and hell with Jesus' last words he's breathing and he's thinking about me he's thinking about you and he screams out and he yells pay in full at that moment your debt was paid for all of eternity all yeah of say God I want your forgiveness God I need you to forgive me here is my sin God here is what I've done We some, maybe some of you right now God is speaking to you and you've got something in your life and you've got something 
some sin and you say, God, I need you to forgive me. I want you to come up to this altar right now and I want you to hit your knees because we're going to hit our knees before God tonight and say, God, forgive me of my unrighteousness. God, forgive me of my sin. God, cleanse me. Purify me from all the things, whatever it might be. You, what you might have been going through might be written on that wall. But can I tell you something in this moment when you're asking for forgiveness? This is what Jesus is saying right now. He is saying pay him for. When you ask for that forgiveness, the blood of Jesus is sprinkling all over this room. Forgiveness is here right now. Forgiveness is here right now. If you need that forgiveness, don't, don't stay in that seat if you need that forgiveness. If you need it, come on. Come on and hit your knees and cry out to Jesus. Come on, somebody. We got to worship and we got to pray and we got to say, God, I just need your forgiveness. All it took for the thief on the cross was acknowledging that Jesus was Lord. Because he acknowledged who he was. He said, just remember me. Jesus is looking at some of you right now as you're on your knees. He's saying, you will be with me in paradise. You're making a decision right now for Jesus. You're making a decision that says, Jesus, just be my Lord. Be my Savior. If you're up here and you're needing that forgiveness, I just want you to repeat this prayer after me. Repeat it aloud so you can hear your own voice. More importantly, believe it in your heart. For those of you that you've already been forgiven, you're already serving Jesus, I'd ask that you repeat this in support of those who raise their hand. If everybody would say, Father, Father I come to you now. I come to you now. Seeking, Seeking salvation. salvation. So right now, so right now I, confess with my mouth, I confess with my mouth and believe in my heart, in my heart that, Jesus that Jesus is Lord, is Lord that you sent church all in the bed as a family for a little bit for me and wifey kicked him out and watched the challenge but we're chilling all under the covers and Lavelle just we're chilling it's nice and quiet there's a commercial on and Lavelle's like and he drops a bomb you farted did you fart Lavelle no. she's trying to deny it as wifey, as wifey calls it, she was playing the booty trumpet. Lorraine, was it you? No, it was her. Did you do it, Lorraine? No. Lorraine be playing the booty trumpet too, and she be trying to play it off like she's no. too good to fart. Not me. Well, you be farting. Lorraine be like, oh, excuse me. Uh, excuse me. Excuse no. Eee, Lavelle. Booty trumpet. <laughs> Alright, so question of the day. Coming to you from wifey is what is your most prized possession? Lorraine, what is your most prized possession? Yeah, I cookies and ice cream and cake. Cookies and ice cream and cake. No, I Lavelle, said. Lavelle, what's your most prized possession? Um, my blankie. Your blankie? <laughs> wifey, what's your most prized possession? My, my hair. hair. Your hair. My most prized possession but mommy already said is that. my family, and if it's not like people and stuff, I don't have one because I don't care about stuff that much. Yeah, no, we're not talking about people. Obviously, all of our answers would have been different. Possession, family, not a possession. What do you mean? I possess y'all. No, possess you, you? Yes, I do. You do not. Okay. I think I don't. <laughs> we're not things. We're nope. people. I possess you. <laughs> Dada. Forever. Dada. I'm not, I'm not Daddy. Forever. You're crazy. Daddy, I have a question. But as far as things, yeah, I'm not like I'm not that person that's like all sentimental. Like, oh, my mama gave me that. Oh, my wife bought me that. Like, if it breaks, Daddy. 
Like, wifey would get upset. She'd be like, oh, no, you bought me that necklace. It is broke. If wifey buys you something, it breaks. I'm like, dang, that sucks. But I don't get, like, attached to something. Like, I had some stuff that was from my pops, and he passed away. And I lost it. I don't know where it's at. But it's not like, oh, my God, that was my dad's. I lost it. Because that's not him. It never was him. You know what I mean? So, but I'm just weird like that. I don't really care about birthdays and everything, too, so I'm like a weird person. I met you went into a rant about how you don't care about stuff while we're asking everybody to post the stuff that they care about. Like, I don't even feel like they well, can't no, care about no, things. No, 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 we're just, I'm not saying that that's bad that you care about things. I'm just, I'm, I'm answering the question that I don't, so I don't you have to go into detail about how you don't care about people's day of birth and everything else. I like, don't. Why could this this is like what daily that, doses for that has nothing to do we we knew that the other day when you didn't know how old your brothers were. Like you didn't have to go into your old man grumpy rat. That's not an old man grumpy rat. Just yes, cause it you is. know okay do you want to I go don't care a... about things and I don't care about days of the <laughs> rat <laughs> Okay. What? Okay. Okay. Why so, are so you, you want to go? So you want to go into like a little rainbow and marshmallows, red? Go ahead. <laughs> no, I go don't. Ahead. Rainbows and marshmallows. You killed the vibe. Go ahead. We're rainbows. talking about blankies and cupcakes and weave, and you want to be like, I don't care about nothing except my family because I possess y'all. Like, <laughs> exactly. What? That's my point, though. That, that's I not a good a answer. I suppose. You just mad because mine's better than yours, Lorraine. What's your question? I like cake. That's not a question. That's Lavelle, a statement. Lavelle, come punch the camera. Okay. Right there? That little dot? Yep, punch the little dot. No, this dot right there. Punch it. Sissy, kick it. Sissy, do your, 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 what you did this year. <laughs> do <that>. <laughs> <laughs> You gotta Just go go gadget foot. Like, Lavelle, what punch it. Doing? Punch the camera. Kick it. <laughs> no. Lavelle, you gotta hit the little dot. Punch the little dot. Right there. Punch that dot. Punch it. No, the dot. 